For the past few years, WKU has signed joint admissions agreements with nine community colleges in Kentucky, Indiana, and Tennessee. The growing number of students choosing to complete their degrees at WKU now have a central location to get all the help they need. Just this semester, we've increased versus last spring semester by 150 transfer students. And that number is expected to keep climbing thanks to the joint admissions agreements WKU has signed with nine community colleges. The main thing that we're trying with our transfer center is to make sure that the students who are coming from the community and technical college, they're taking the correct courses. The transfer center opened on the second floor of the Downing Student Union last semester and became fully staffed about a month ago. I work with you know everywhere from the non-traditional student who uh, decided to go back to school later in life and they're just kind of figuring out their passion uh, to the students who are fresh out of high school and they come here with their parents. One staff member is dedicated to helping international students and making sure they are college ready. I feel really comfortable when I come here. He helped me to register all classes and choose my classes. Walk-ins are welcome at the center. The staff also makes regular visits to the community colleges to answer questions about transferring. I kind of serve as that liaison in those interactions to uh, help them transition to a larger setting but still can be you know just as intimate and you know students have tons of opportunities here. Opportunities the transfer center wants to highlight for incoming students. Knowing that I play a role in assisting a student achieve their academic goals it's very rewarding. Today, WKU is one of 16 colleges taking part in Transfer Madness, an online college fair. To find out more about WKU's Transfer Center, including course equivalency and scholarship information, log on to wku.edu transfer. With this week's View from the Hill, I'm Amy Bingham.